dozen job titles that you can apply for once you master this skill set. Um, ranging from UI developer, front end developer, full stack developer, React, JavaScript developer, and so on. And basically, the way you do this is you do this iteratively. So you don't want to dive directly into React. This is an anti pattern. And many, many candidates have been re rejected because they learned React before they learned JavaScript, for example. Sure. And so you want to learn the fundamentals. When we talk about fundamentals, yes, data structures are an important sort of fundamental. But before you learn an abstract data structure, I recommend learning a concrete data structure. And so the stage in which I introduced abstract data structures and leak coding and things like that is when you're moving on to language number two. And if I realize that a, mm. a dictionary in Python is like an object in JavaScript, how so is it different? I abstract up to a thing called a hash map. And this is like right. the perfect time to introduce data structures. But before we introduce the abstracto, let's learn the concreta and let's build something specific. Okay, so we're going to build something specific with React. What should I build? Maybe let's build something you already know. That way I can hold the business domain constant. I can increase your speed of learning because it's something you already know. I love that. Yeah, that's, that's so good. And I find that when people, because sometimes they'll say, hey, like you got to build things to get better. And they go, well, what do I build?